for our top story. Suzuki Philippines recently invited 30 motoring journalists for the ride and drive of their soon-to-be-released subcompact, the all-new SIAZ, which stands for City from A to Z. The test drive took the mountain roads of Tagaytay all the way to Anilao in Batangas. We are happy to invite our, uh, our media friend, um, maybe around 30 persons kindly attend for a test drive of our new subcompact sedan, uh, Sears, uh, at the uh, Ayana Beach Resort in Batangas. We say this uh, vehicle as a subcompact sedan. Subcompact sedan in the Philippines is the biggest market. So uh, we, Suzuki Philippines, decided to bring this vehicle in the Philippines. Our product sales feature is, maybe we can say, our Sears is the biggest size in this category so that we can provide a, a comfortability for all passengers. We will bring a, a three variant, a middle and uh, minor and automatic and high end uh, automatic. See that uh, our media friend drove today is a, a high end. So therefore, uh, we can show to the a bit uh, a middle uh, end of uh, Seats in this, in this market. Powered with a 1.4-liter K14B inline-4, same as their Ertiga MPV and Swift, the Siaza's powertrain delivers a maximum output of 98 PS at 6,000 RPM, with maximum torque of 130 Nm at 4,000 RPM, which is then connected to a 4-speed automatic gearbox. The Suzuki Siaz is considered to be the biggest among its competitors in the D-segment sedans. I would like to invite everybody to please do check out our uh, dealership, about 51 different dealerships across the Philippines for you to see and have a glimpse of the actual unit of SIAS. And uh, we highly encourage you to drive it, test it, and uh, to be convinced that this is actually a smarter choice for you uh, now. The suggested retail prices for the SIAS are as follows. Sia's GLMT 738,000 pesos. Sia's GLAT 773,000 pesos. Sia's GLX80 888,000 pesos. Meanwhile, British United Automobile, the exclusive distributors of Mini vehicles in the country, recently unveiled the all-new Mini Club Men at the Green Sun Events Place in Makati to take on the premium compact sedan segment. Now we're so excited tonight that we launched the Mini Club Man. It's, uh, it's actually a comeback uh, from the old Club Man. Now it has four full-size doors, no? So the car is so much longer, wider, more legroom, more space, and at the same time, the power is still there, no? So it comes with two models, the Cooper and the Cooper S. And, and of course, uh, all that I can say is that, because the impression on the Mini is always for the single, the active lifestyle, but now, uh, uh, we have a new model that's for the family. No? So if, if people love to bring their family on trips, this would be the perfect car. And at the same time, you still have the same go-kart feeling. So you will still enjoy the, the drive of a Mini on a bigger car now. The new Mini Club Man, which is significantly larger than its predecessor model, is presented to have a distinctive body concept, high-quality materials, and finish quality. It also has new features in the areas of drive, suspension comfort, safety, controls, and connectivity based on the latest Mini generation. Its status as the largest representative of the new Mini generation is also clearly shown in comparison with the Mini 5 door. The new Mini Clubman is longer and wider than the Mini 5 door, while its wheelbase is also longer. Its luggage compartment has a volume of 360 liters, which can be extended to as much as 1,250 liters by folding down the rear backrest with its 40-20-40 split. The Mini Cooper S Clubman and Mini Cooper Clubman are both retailing at Mini Global City, 
Mini Roadshow Green Hills and Mini Cebu for 3,200,000 pesos and 2,700,000 pesos respectively. To all the televiewers out there, please uh, do drop by uh, Mini. Uh, we have three showrooms nationwide, one in Global City, the other one is in Green Hills, and, and another one, of course, in Cebu. No? Uh, test drive the new Mini Clubman. I'm sure you're going to love it. Now even your children and your wife would, would, and your spouse would love the new Clubman. Meantime, Honda Cars Philippines Incorporated, or HCPI, recently released its sales performance figures for 2015 that amounted to total sales of 19,315 units. Honda's performance in the 2015 passenger car sales report was led by the city, which delivered retail sales of 8,732, followed by the Jazz with 1,986 units sold. Next was the mini subcompact Honda Brio with 1,122 units sold, followed by Brio Amaze with 794 units, then the all-time favorite Civic with 752 units sold, followed by Accord with 130 units, CRZ with 28, and the newly launched all-new Legend with 9 units sold. For the commercial vehicle segment, Honda Mobilio got the highest sales for 2015 with 2,968 units sold, followed by the compact SUV CRV with 1,270 units, the all new HRV with 1,042 units sold, the luxury van Odyssey with 461 units, and the newly launched Pilot with 21 units sold. Motor Philippines recently held at the Clark International Speedway the first leg of the 2016 Vios Cup, now regarded as the biggest motorsports event in the country. We have a new uh, drivers uh, joining us and uh, we will have a, a new venue uh, using uh, different provincial uh, areas. So uh, each race may be more exciting I think for people. I'm really exciting uh, because uh, when I was in the regional office, I actually planned to have uh, this kind of uh, uh, one make race. Then uh, in Philippines, I could see uh, this kind of a successful racing. Uh, so maybe this successful case in Philippines can lead a similar uh, racing event in other country also. So I'm really exciting uh, now current uh, success in Philippines. Toyota Motor Philippines invites everyone to watch out for further announcements as to where and when the second leg of the Vios Cup Season 3 would be held as they continue their efforts to bring motorsports nearer to the public. We're very happy. Actually, it's been uh, talked about. Everyone's very excited. Everyone's asking when will the next race be? Where will the next race be? So, I mean, it makes us very happy to know that people really look forward to watching this Vios Cup. And um, I mean, even when I spoke to some celebrities, it's already being talked about. I mean, uh, who, who can join? How can we join the Vios Cup? So it's, it's really fun. I mean, it's really great. So I'd like to invite everyone. Uh, we will have the. We will still have three races for the year. We'd like to invite you, and uh, we'll just give you more information as soon as it becomes available. Thank you.